Hi, toddlers. My name's Lizzie, and I'm the new teacher in Toddler 127. I'm so excited to finally be talking to you guys, and I'm so excited to share you a story today. So the story I'm going to read to you is Grumpy Bird. What do you think this is going to be about? Hmm. Well, it looks like it's a bird, and it looks like he's grumpy. So let's see what's going on in the book. When Bird woke up, he was grumpy. Do you ever feel grumpy when you wake up? Sometimes I feel grumpy when I wake up. It's okay to feel grumpy sometimes. He was too grumpy to eat. He was too grumpy to play. In fact, he was too grumpy to fly. Looks like I'm walking today, said Bird. Bird walked past Sheep. Good morning, Bird, said Sheep. What are you doing? Walking, said Bird. Nice, said Sheep. I'll keep you company. What do you notice about Bird's face? He looks grumpy. Bird walked past Rabbit. Hi there, Bird, said Rabbit. What are you doing? I'm walking, said Bird. It's no fun. I could use some exercise, said Rabbit. I'll walk too. So now there's one, two, three animals that are going to be walking. Bird walked past Raccoon. Hey, Bird, said Raccoon. What are you doing? I'm walking, snapped Bird. What does it look like? It looks like fun, said Raccoon. I'm coming too. So now there's one, two, three, four friends. Bird walked past Beaver. Hello, Bird, said Beaver. What are you doing? Let me give you a hint, said Bird. You do it by placing one foot in front of the other. Walking, guessed Beaver. I love walking. Bird walked past Fox. Good day, Bird, said Fox. What are you doing? Why does everyone want to know what I'm doing? Shouted Bird. I'm just walking, okay? Okay, said Fox. Let's go. Why do we think that Bird is using a grumpy voice? And what do you notice is going on? I see now there's one, two, three, four, five, People walking with Bird, and there's six, including Bird. Bird walked. The other animals walked. Bird stopped. The other animals stopped. Bird stood on one leg. The other animal stood on one leg. Bird jumped. The other animals jumped. I noticed that they're doing the same thing as Bird. I think they're trying to cheer Bird up. Hey, this is fun, said Bird. Look at Bird's face, it doesn't look as grumpy anymore. Come on, said Bird, who had forgotten all about being grumpy. Let's fly back to my nest for a snack.
and they did. So it looked like for Bird, all Bird needed to um, get in a better mood and be a little bit happier is just to spend time with his friends and to have some nice company and to get a little bit of exercise. So he took a nice walk with some friends and that cheered him up. I know sometimes when I'm feeling a little bit grumpy or a little bit sad, I like to hang out with my friends or my family and spend time with them. And sometimes taking a little walk helps me to breathe and calm down too. So it was so nice finally talking to you toddlers. I'm so happy to be a teacher in your class and I will see you next week. So I hope you enjoyed the story. Have a nice week and stay safe toddlers.